In the expansive world of composting, where nature's alchemy transforms discarded organic matter into a potent elixir for soil health, there exists a vital yet often overlooked step, the meticulous process of sifting worms from their castings. It is a practice steeped in tradition yet refined through modern techniques, requiring not only patience and precision, but also a profound appreciation for the interconnectedness of all living things. At its core, sifting worms from castings is an exercise in efficiency, a means of extracting the full potential of compost while minimizing waste and disruption. It is a practice born out of necessity, as composting enthusiasts seek to maximize the benefits of their labor and steward the precious resources entrusted to them by nature. By separating the valuable worm castings from their tiny creators, the earthworms, composters unlock a treasure trove of nutrients and beneficial microbes that enrich the soil and nourish plants. These castings, often referred to as black gold, for their unparalleled fertility, represent the culmination of nature's intricate processes of decomposition and regeneration. But the significance of sifting extends far beyond the realm of practicality. It is a reflection of our commitment to sustainability and environmental stewardship, a tangible expression of our reverence for the natural world. In an age marked by ecological crises and resource depletion, composting offers a beacon of hope a simple yet profound solution to the complex challenges facing our planet. However, sifting worms from castings is not without its challenges. It demands time, effort, and a certain level of skill to achieve optimal results. From homemade screens fashioned from wire mesh to commercial sifters with rotating drums, there are myriad methods to choose from, each with its own set of advantages and limitations. Yet, regardless of the tools employed, the essence of the process remains the same, a harmonious integration of human ingenuity and natural processes. Moreover, sifting worms from castings invites us to contemplate our relationship with the natural world in a deeper sense. It serves as a poignant reminder of the interconnectedness of all living things and the profound impact of our actions on the delicate balance of ecosystems. As we sift through the compost, we are reminded of the countless organisms, from microscopic bacteria to industrious earthworms, that inhabit this rich tapestry of life. It is a humbling experience that fosters a sense of reverence for the wonders of nature and our role within it. In essence, sifting worms from castings is a microcosm of the larger composting process, a journey of transformation, renewal, and growth. It is a reminder that even in the smallest of actions, we have the power to effect profound change. So let us embrace the art of sifting with open minds and willing hands, knowing that in doing so, we contribute to a healthier, more sustainable future for generations to come. As we delve deeper into the intricacies of sifting worms from castings, it becomes apparent that this seemingly mundane task is imbued with layers of complexity and significance. It is a process that begins long before the first scoop of compost is sifted, rooted in an understanding of the biology and behavior of earthworms, as well as the principles of decomposition and soil ecology. The first step in the journey of sifting is understanding the role of earthworms in the composting process. These humble creatures, often underestimated in their significance, play a pivotal role in breaking down organic matter and aerating the soil. As they consume decaying plant material and microorganisms, they excrete nutrient-rich castings, a byproduct of their digestive processes that serves as a potent fertilizer for plants. In a composting system, earthworms thrive in the warm, moist environment created by decaying organic matter. They burrow through the compost pile, ingesting and digesting organic material as they go. Over time, their castings accumulate, mingling with the surrounding compost and enriching it with nutrients and beneficial microbes. As the composting process progresses, the earthworm population within the pile grows, creating a dense network of burrows and tunnels. These tunnels serve as conduits for air and water, 
facilitating the decomposition process and promoting the growth of beneficial microorganisms. In essence, the earthworms act as ecosystem engineers, shaping the physical and chemical properties of the compost pile in profound ways. However, as the composting process nears completion, it becomes necessary to separate the valuable worm castings from the earthworms themselves. This is where the art of sifting comes into play. By carefully sifting through the compost, composters can extract the nutrient-rich castings while minimizing harm to the earthworm population. There are several methods for sifting worms from castings, each with its own advantages and limitations. One common approach is to use a series of screens or sieves of varying mesh sizes to separate the castings from the worms and larger pieces of organic material. Another method involves creating a mound of compost and allowing the earthworms to migrate to the bottom, where they can be collected and returned to the compost pile. Regardless of the method chosen, the process of sifting requires patience, attention to detail, and a willingness to adapt to the needs of the composting system. It is a task that demands both physical and mental stamina, as composters sift through countless scoops of compost in search of the elusive black gold buried within. Yet, despite the challenges inherent in the process, the rewards are well worth the effort. The nutrient-rich castings harvested through sifting are a valuable resource for gardeners and farmers alike, providing a natural alternative to chemical fertilizers and soil amendments. In addition to their nutritional value, worm castings also improve soil structure, water retention, and microbial activity, leading to healthier, more resilient plants. Moreover, the act of sifting worms from castings fosters a deeper connection to the natural world and a greater appreciation for the intricate web of life that sustains us. It is a reminder that even in our most mundane tasks, we are part of something greater, a vast and complex ecosystem that transcends boundaries and spans generations. In conclusion, the art of sifting worms from castings is more than just a practical necessity. It is a testament to our commitment to sustainability, our reverence for the natural world, and our dedication to nurturing the soil that sustains us all. As we sift through the compost, let us do so with humility and gratitude knowing that in our hands lies the power to cultivate a healthier, more sustainable future for ourselves and for generations to come.